Hello! Welcome to my channel, Bree Sheree Bree. <laughs> um, welcome to my channel. If you are new here, hi, welcome. Um, join the family. If you are a returning subscriber, thank you for coming back and dealing with my extremely long, ridiculous, corny videos. So, today's not any different. We're gonna, we're gonna organize this. We're going to take care of my shows. So right now my daughter is at the trampoline park with her friends. And, oh, <laughs> and while I have the time, I am going to organize my space. Yay! I'm so excited. And, <laughs> and when I mean organize, the way my system is set up is I have... Everything organized just like a library. Everything is by genre um, and then last names. So, I like that method. I'm used to it because, again, libraries. But, um, except for this shelf, this shelf will be for my black authors and dedicated to my black authors. I want them all right here. It will still be separated by genre and whatnot. So, yeah. I gotta get my computer because I don't know what some of these genres are. <laughs> I might have an idea, but I don't want to guess. I'm gonna clean all my, my shelves and wipe them down because, you know, dust, dead skin cells, that's, that's a thing. So, I, I'm just saying. <laughs> so, I'm gonna go ahead and do that and let's go ahead and get started. This is going to be probably a really long time lapse so hopefully I can find some really good music but I want to do this in the next two hours that's gonna be so much fun all right let's get started y'all ready yeah
I moved all my books. Let me show you guys where I'm at. This is all adult fan YA fantasy. Um, YA fantasy, adult fantasy, Sanderson. <laughs> and then a little bit of a adult fantasy. Um, and then contemporaries, romance. Whew. Okay, so the way that this is going to work is um, YA black authors, um, adult black authors, adult black authors, fantasy, um, hmm, hopefully adult <laughs> black author, fantasy, contemporary, and then I have middle grade right there. Um, so this will be YA adult fantasy, basically, Cont a little bit of contemporary that I have, and then, um, middle grade. So I might move, actually, middle grade up here, because I read a lot of middle grade compared to contemporary. I'm separating my thrillers. Um, this will be mystery down here, and then horror will be over here somewhere, so... That's how we're going to do that. I don't think I need two shelves. So these are two little thin shelves. I don't think I need two thin shelves for mystery, thriller, and horror. But I do want to separate them. Um, so I might actually do this top half. Put that back into contemporary as well if I need more space. We shall see. I got to take care of my fantasy section real quick. And then we'll see what that looks like moving forward. So yeah. <laughs>
you guys are cricket, but hey, it's temporary. Um, I'm finished for now. Whew. Lord, um, I'm tired. I cleaned off my shelves. Freaking disgusting, and I promise you I clean them February, and I wipe them down back in February, so I definitely recommend doing that more often. I'm happy with what I have. Some books need to be organized by last name, but I have them in the right category. I have this entire shelf for black authors, which I'm right, usually when I film vid videos, I'm right in front of it, so I want my black authors to be together. I'm going to show you guys briefly what I have, and I'll try to explain. Hopefully I can get the right views. I'm going to change my battery to my camera real quick, and then I'm going to go ahead and jump into it and show you guys what it looks like. Um, yeah. I'm so thankful that I have a lot more space left, or some space left, because I'm not getting another bookshelf. I'm, I'm not doing it. I refuse. So... <laughs> So thankful that I have more space, um, especially with horror. So let's go ahead and check it out real quick, and then that will be it. That will be it. It took less than two hours, and so I'm so thankful for that. So let's go ahead and show you what I have. All right, so I still have to organize a little bit, but hopefully you guys get the gist. Um, this is all... YA, regular YA, non, there are some BIPOC authors in here, so just so you know, like, BIPOC authors will be in here, but my black authors, which are separate, is all over here, okay, so this is not by BIPOC, this is literally separated by black authors, and then everyone else, <laughs> so I'm, I hope you guys understand. I just really want my black authors to have their space. Anyway, I don't know where I'm going to put this. Whatever. Okay, so. YA fantasy. YA fantasy. YA fantasy. Adult fantasy. Um, more adult fantasy. Brandon, Sa <laughs> Brandon Sanderson. And this includes... Middle grade Sanderson, too. I just threw them all together because, uh, why not? Anyway, more adult fantasy, a dog, <laughs> and then contemporary nonfiction, contemporary and nonfiction down there. I don't, I need to unhaul that book. Um, so yeah. Okay, so. The, this shelf, this entire shelf, is black authors. All right, you guys ready? Why fantasy? Ooh, except for Clark. I don't think the Unbroken is YA. I'll fix it later. Anyways, then it jumps into YA. Um, this is all YA. 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 And then it jumps into an adult. I have all N.K. Jemisin's books here, except for, oh, there. <laughs> I'm like, I am no, I'm missing one. So, all N.K. Jemisin's books, I have all, mostly all her novels. Um, so, they're there. Um, more adult, all in um, Nettie Aquafor books are right here. Except for her YA, which her YA are up here. I want all of N.K. Jemison's N.K. Jemison's books in Nettie, Dr. Nettie Aquafor. I want her books too. So I have. Anyways, so then we jump into adults. Um, we're still at the adult fantasy. This is a contemporary book. I think both of these are contemporary. So I need to move those, but they're there. And then we have. Black authors, whores, mysteries, and thrillers, right here. Then we jump into black authors, middle grade, right here. Um, and then we have all of our contemporary nonfiction, 
memoirs, nonfiction, you know, all that other stuff, um, contemporary, all mixed up down there. <laughs> and then some here, nonfiction and whatnot. So I need to move that in, separate them from nonfiction and contemporary. I will do that later. I was too tired. It's time to, it's time to wrap up and do dinner and laundry. Um, so I will eventually separate nonfiction, look, wills, memoirs, um, and whatnot from each other, but we have them there. Moving on. This is my TBR, my TBR for this month. Um, we go into thrillers, more thrillers, horror, more horror, mystery, right here, romance, middle grade, so everyone else, right there. And so this is romance, this is a little bit more romance, and that is a thrift haul that I've recently done, and I left it in the bag, so I left it there. This is an empty shelf with my Sanderson notes, notebook, so our journal for my Sanderson read along, so... And that is Luna on my floor, taking over my floor. Um, so let me give you an overview of what everything look like. looks like. Um, I still need my two lights. They've been sold out since last year, so I am still waiting for those bad boys. But this is what it looks like. I have so much space in these cubicles. I have no intention of filling them up. And I'm just going to leave them the way they are. But I'm so glad my fantasy is together. My thrillers are separated from my mystery and horror. And my black authors have their shelf that they deserve. So that is going to be it. I hope you enjoyed this video. Go ahead and like and subscribe. If you like this video, go ahead and like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.